Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new, make sure you hit that subscribe button and let's get right into this video. So here's what we're going to be using for this nail set. We're just going to need a nude poly gel. I have these two colors. This is a light blue and a light green, but I'm going to mix them together to make more of like a minty color. And we're also going to need some white gel polish and I'm going to be using some of this clear iridescent glitter. And that's pretty much all we're going to need. So let's just get right into this nail set. Oh my gosh. And I almost forgot to show you this nail decoration right here. I've unlocked full spring mode with these. They are some like 3D flowers in all the pastel spring colors. I've seen so many nail sets using this. I'm gonna be using this so much. And can you blame me? They're just so cute. So yeah, we're also gonna be using these today. Okay, so here's how my nails look. I still have the nail set on from my last video. And I thought I would show you guys how I take these off. So I do put a peel off base coat on these nails. So they pop off really easily. I just have the other end of the cuticle pusher and I kind of just lift up on the sides here. And there you have it, all the nails popped off. And now I just put them in my nail candy container. This is my container where I keep all of my nails that I've popped off. It's getting kind of full though. I'll probably have to upgrade her. Mm, Y'all remember this nail set? Sometimes I just go in this container and I just look at the different nails that I've done and just remember how fun they were to do. All right, so here's how my nails are looking. Just a little bit crusty from the last nail set. So I'm just gonna like scrape up all of that excess poly gel that's like around the cuticle area. Okay, so to make sure that all of this excess residue is gone, I'm just going to file around the cuticle area with my fine grit sanding band. Okay, next I'm gonna add on my pop-off base coat, which is just some cuticle oil and then a layer of top coat. Okay, so I have my peel-off base coat on my nails and now we're just gonna get sizing out the nail tips. Okay, so I'm just gonna glue on the nail tips with some base coat. Okay, so I have all the nail tips glued on. Okay, and I think I'm gonna trim these down. Okay, so here's the length of the nails. And now I'm just going to reshape them. Okay, next I'm gonna use my fine grit sanding band and I'm just gonna remove the shine from the nail tips. Here's how the nail tips are looking. And now we're just gonna add on a layer of base coat. Okay, so once all the base coat is on, now let's get into this poly gel application. For this nail set, we're just gonna be making all the nails nude. I've been doing like a lot of one colored nail sets recently, but we're gonna be adding on some nail art. So I'm just going to be taking this nude poly gel and I'm gonna put it on the entire nail. So I'm just gonna put one bead down the middle and I'm gonna start at the cuticle area. I'm just gonna push this poly gel as close to the skin as I can, but not touching the skin. And I'm just going to continue to drag up all this poly gel down the nail. Okay, 
Okay, so the thumbnail is done and now I'm going to move on to the next nail. So just like the last nail, I'm just going to be using one bead of poly gel. Luckily, this McCart poly gel is like a really good consistency. So I only have to do one bead instead of dividing the nail up into two layers. <laughs> Also, happy March, everyone. Beginning of March, and my birthday is this month, so you'll be getting some birthday nail videos. I'm not really sure what I want to do for my birthday nails. I'll definitely figure them out. really loving doing spring nails this first couple of spring nails that i have done i just love them so much and i have so many nail sets that i want to do and i'm pretty sure spring doesn't even start until the end of march but we're starting now and if you have any suggestions for some spring nail sets or like colors that you want you can definitely leave those in the comments Okay, so here's how the nails are looking after I have all the poly gel on. And now I'm gonna wipe off this sticky layer that gets left on the nails after you cure the poly gel. I got these lint-free wipes from Amazon 
and i like them because they were pink but they kind of leave behind little pieces of like pink i don't know if you can see it right there but it's kind of annoying <laughs> maybe the stickiness of the poly gel is just too much for these wipes yeah and here's how the nails look i'm really proud of this application i think the nails just look really pretty okay and now we're just going to be reshaping the nails i just have my mccart dust collector and a hand file and yeah let's just get reshaping the nails Okay, so here's how the nails are looking after they have been shaped very very pretty but now we are going to get into the nail art so for this nail art we're going to be drawing on some french tips and then we're going to be sprinkling in some of this clear iridescent glitter i'm just going to start by making like a mint color so i'm just going to mix together this light green and some of this light blue Okay, so I think this is a good enough color. Okay, so we're just gonna start off by making a French tip. So I'm gonna start on the thumbnail. I'm gonna make these kind of like a deep French tip. Okay, so here's how the French tip looks. And now I'm going to sprinkle in this iridescent glitter. So here's how the nail looks. I don't think it's giving the right vibe. I don't think it's what I really want. And also I kind of did all the things backward. I want this to be like a sugared nail. So I don't want to put top coat over it. And I didn't top coat the nail first or anything like that. And then the under layer of this is the gel polish. So that's going to be like sticky after I cure it. So I don't think I'm going to use this glitter. It's just too green sparkly. I just want it to be more about the mint color, not really the glitter. So I'm going to wipe this off. So our next Next attempt is going to be this glitter right here. I don't know if this is going to be enough. Look at this tiny little bottle. But we're going to try it and I'm going to, oh, I was going to say I'm going to try not to waste it, but I spilled some of it already. <gasps> so I have my little piece of trash here holding my excess glitter before I paint on the French tip, which you can kind of see the outline right there. Unfortunately, it's getting covered up. I'm going to paint a layer of top coat over the nails. Okay, now I'm going to go cure this top coat in the nail lamp. Okay, so now that we got a layer of top coat on, now I'm actually going to go and paint the French tip. Okay, 
Okay, so I think this is good enough. I'm gonna go ahead and cure this now. Okay, and now I'm gonna take some top coat and I'm just going to fill in all of this green part so that we can sprinkle on the glitter. Okay, and now I'm just gonna sprinkle on this glitter. I think this is a much better glitter. It kind of just shows off the mint color better. I'm gonna go ahead and cure this. And we're just gonna do the same thing on the pointer finger and the pinky finger. So here's how the French tips turned out. Now we're going to move on to the ring finger. I don't know what you would call this kind of design. Okay, so we're just gonna move on to the middle finger. I'm going to be using these cute 3D flowers. So I already have a layer of top coat on my nails and to adhere these flowers, I'm gonna put a tiny bit of clear poly gel on the backs of them. But for the really tiny flowers, I'm just gonna use top coat. Actually, I think I'm just gonna use top coat for all of them. <laughs> So this looks so cute. I'm gonna go ahead and cure this. Wait, wait, what? They turned orange. I'm not crazy, right? They turned orange. Are they color changing or? Guys, these flowers are color changing. Look, these ones turn dark blue. These ones, they, they really do change. I guess these flowers are color changing. I guess it's all right. I just wasn't really expecting that. They're supposed to change back to white, but you know, it might take a little bit. So we're just going to add in those tiny pearls that go in the middle of the nail. I'm just gonna take some top coat and Put a tiny drop in the middle of the flowers. I'm gonna get these silver pearls. I'm just gonna drop them in the middle of the flowers. 
are these even supposed to be color changing on amazon it literally just said that they were pastel but maybe i didn't read it all the way no actually i don't think they're supposed to be color changing in the description on amazon it didn't say anything about color changing so i think it's just the flowers reacting to the uv if you're gonna get these flowers just beware that they do color change but they do turn back well those are our flowers i'm gonna go ahead and cure on those beads also i'm just remembering that these nails were supposed to be matte but i forgot to do the matte but i think they look cute glossy yeah we already added on top coat and now we're just gonna finish this nail saw off with some cuticle oil how the nails turned out let me know what you guys think of this nail set in the comments i really really love them they are so cute the only thing is like everything was going so well until the flowers i didn't know they were color changing so this is what we have it's still really cute and it'll turn back to white eventually it's almost back to white yeah here's how the nails look i think they're so cute the glittery french tip is really pretty and i love this nail i love the ring finger and i really do love the flowers i think that's just adds like the perfect touch but um it'll be even better when they change back to white this was just a really fun nail set to do it's just perfect for spring i kind of wish that i made the minty color a little bit more on the green side i think i'm obsessed with these these are so cute and you can do this in so many different colors as well but that is pretty much it for this nail set thank you guys for watching i hope you all enjoyed make sure you like comment and subscribe and i will talk to you all next time bye